Nasiruddin Shah, who has dropped a bombshell. In fact, the veteran actor has said that he feels anxious for his children because tomorrow if a mob surrounds them and asks, are you a Hindu or a Muslim, they will have no answer, says actor Nasiruddin Shah. In fact, he says the poison has already spread in the society. There is complete impunity for those who take law into their own hands. He says that they have already witnessed uh, the death of uh, a cow that has more significance than the death of a police officer in India today. Some very, very, uh, you know, controversial statements and some hard-hitting uh, remarks being made by the veteran actor Nasiruddin Shah. He speaks about communal poison. He claims that it's already spread in India. He fears for his children and is anxious for their security as well. Listen in. Dubara is is jin ko botal mein band karna bada mushkil hoga. Khuli chhoot mil gai hai. Kanun ko apne haathon mein lene ki. Kai 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 ilaqo mein hum log dekh rahe hain ki ek 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 gaye ki maut ko zyada ahmiyat di jati hai ek police officer ki maut ke banisbat. Mujhe fikr hoti hai. اپنی اولاد کے بارے میں سوچ کر کیونکہ ان کا مذہب ہی نہیں ہے مذہبی تعلیم مجھے ملی تھی اور رتنا کو بہت کم ملی تھی لیکن مجھے تھوڑی زیادہ ملی تھی اس کو بالکل بھی نہیں ایک لیبرل ہاؤس ہول تھا اس کا اور ہم نے اپنے بچوں کو مذہبی تعلیم بالکل نہیں دی کیونکہ میرا یہ ماننا ہے کہ اچھائی اور برائی کا مذہب سے کچھ لینا دینا نہیں ہے اچھائی اور برائی کے بارے میں ضرور ان کو سکھایا جو ہمارے بلیوز ہیں دنیا کے بارے میں وہ ہم نے ان کو سکھائے قرآن شریف کی ایک آدھ آیت یاد ضرور کروئے کیونکہ میرا ماننا ہے کہ اس کا تلفظ صدرتا ہے اس کے ریاض سے جس طرح سے ہندی کا تلفظ صدرتا ہے رامائن یا مہابارت پڑھ کے ان اٹس اوریجنل اور خوش قسمتی سے میں نے بچپن میں عربی قرآن شریف پڑھی تھی کئی آیتیں مجھے اب بھی یاد ہیں اس کی وجہ سے میرے خاص سے میرا تلفظ ہے تو فکر مجھے ہوتی ہے اپنے بچوں کے بارے میں کیونکہ کل کو انہیں کوئی اگر ایک بھیڑ نے گھیر لیا کہ تم ہندو ہو یا مسلمان تو ان کے پاس تو کوئی جواب ہی نہیں ہوگا اس بات کی فکر ہوتی ہے کیونکہ حالات جلدی سوزرتے تو مجھے نظر نہیں آ رہے ان باتوں سے مجھے ڈر نہیں لگتا غصہ آتا ہے اور میں چاہتا ہوں کہ ہر رائٹ تھنکنگ انسان کو غصہ آنا چاہیے ڈر نہیں لگنا چاہیے ہمیں ہمارا گھر ہے ہمیں کون نکال سکتا ہے یہاں سے یہ زہر پھیل چکا ہے اور اس کو دوبارہ اس جن کو بوتل میں بند کرنا بڑا مشکل ہوگا کھلی چھوٹ مل گئی ہے قانون کو اپنے ہاتھوں میں لینے کی کئی علاقوں میں ہم لوگ دیکھ رہے ہیں کہ ایک گائے کی موت کو زیادہ اہمیت دی جاتی ہے ایک پولیس افسر کی موت کے بنسبت Let me go straight across now to India today's Polomi Saha and you know Polomi Nasiruddin Shah echoing pretty much the same sentiment that was once uh, expressed by uh, another renowned actor Amir Khan uh, Nasiruddin Shah sensing or feeling the sense of insecurity and fear in today's times. Uh, uh, it's very interesting that he makes these remarks uh, and makes a reference to the Bullan Shahir incident as well, where, uh, you know, the, the killers are still on the run and they haven't been booked and how the preference was uh, on, you know, cracking down on the cow slaughterers rather than, uh, you know, putting the culprits behind bars who were accused of killing a cop. That's right. Uh, yes, uh, Nasiruddin Shah seems to be echoing that very same sentiment that was expressed by actor Amir Khan uh, some time ago when he said that me and my wife Kiran Rao discuss uh, whether, you know, it is at all safe for us uh, uh, to stay back uh, in India anymore or should we uh, relocate outside of India. He, of course, faced severe backlash uh, for that statement. Yes. Uh, he lost some very prestigious uh, contracts uh, as well uh, as a result of uh, the backlash which was faced. Uh, but yes, Nasiruddin Shah, this is not the first time he's 
spoken about this. He's uh, spoken previously as well. Right now, of course, he's uh, elaborating on the statement. Earlier, if I recollect right, he had only expressed uh, uh, one sentiment where he had said that it feels a little unsafe uh, uh, to be a Muslim in the country at present and of course uh, right now he's gone on to of course elaborate on that sentiment saying I'm not sure if my uh, children are surrounded uh, what exactly are they supposed to say if a mob uh, tries to accost them and ask them what their religion is because he's married uh, to a Hindu Ratna Patak Shah so uh, you know and he of course uh, in that interview has uh, elaborated how uh, there is no religious education which uh, the children have been imparted with and hence uh, uh, it will become very difficult and of course the reference to the Bulan Shahar killing as well yes, yes. Uh, Based in facts, uh, of course, because the fact is that as far as the Bulan Shaher uh, episode is concerned, like you rightly pointed out, three of the accused who were caught immediately were b those who had been accused of cow slaughter. They were caught. Absolutely. And then, of course, the main accused in the killing of Inspector Subodh Kumar Singh is still out at large. And now, right. yesterday, UP Chief Minister says it's a political conspiracy. So it's unfortunate the turn of events that the Bulan Shahir killing is uh, taking. And uh, right. Rashiruddin Shah ol only just speaking off the back of and that. That's absolutely shocking. Three arrested in the Bulan Shahir case for cow slaughter while the cops' killers are still roaming around uh, freely. Paul Ami, we're going to leave it at that, but thank you so much for joining us.